guys, so I'm going to be like filming an update because I have it in forever. Well, like a week and some days. This thing is being a bit difficult, so I'm sorry about this wait. I'm just going to tell you guys how I'm doing, like, you know, emotionally and. Yes, um. First off, I don't look amazing right now. I know I've had a really tiring, headachey, lightheaded day. Okay, so I'll be walking and I'll like fall over a little bit. I'll notice like I'm not really balanced. Um, and every time after I purge now, I feel like absolute shit. Um, I feel, I actually do, I feel nauseated if I don't purge after I you know, eat to throw up. Um, so I feel nauseated once I'm ready to purge. I'm just like, oh my God, all this food. And I'm like, oh my God. I look at the food I'm eating and I'm like, can't believe I was eating that. <laughs> and then later I'll crave it again. Uh, and to Tumblr people, I'm really sorry if I haven't been like consistently talking to you guys. I've just been like a really shitty person <laughs> lately. Um, not communicating well with others. I'm just kind of in my own little world and I don't seem to get enough of it. I need more alone time. I need more sleeping time. Like this morning, I was so much more exhausted than I usually was in the morning and I had this incredible headache. Um, and then I ate a large apple and I had, um, some crackers with like a cheese like they're the austin cheese crackers um and i had an oatmeal breakfast to go bar like that was in science i was just like oh my gosh i need to eat something maybe i'll feel better then even though i didn't feel like eating i knew that it might help me get rid of this headache and this just crappy feeling overall so it got rid of it and then kylie and bailey came into student lounge and this teacher, um, this girl I know, Taylor's mom's a substitute, she came in there to get coffee, and we just talked for a while, like, I don't know, like, people coming in there and us talking, it, it just, it lifts my mood up, mood up, and it really awakes me. Um, so, I did, uh, I felt like I didn't look good today, like, my bangs were like this, and then my hair was down, so, yeah. Um, I don't even know what I look like right now, to be honest, in this video, so. Uh, I'm just so tired, and I won't be able to sleep. <sighs> like, I'll be tired, but I can't fall asleep, and I hate that. And yeah, I put it in my Christmas tree. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, not mine. This is my brother's old one, but he moved out. Um, then I just have my other one over there. I want to decorate it and stuff, but right now I'm just, ah, uh, guys, uh. Um, so, for, um, health occupations, Karen and I both hate this cause because the guy is just, he's, uh, 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 it's, it's too overwhelming for me. I'm not a girl who can take a ton of responsibilities. I'm just like, okay, I will go to school, stay till four, go home, and just get on with my life and not do anything. Just chill and like eat food and, you know, eh, and then go on Tumblr and talk to people sometimes, but I don't want to talk to them like 24-7. It's like, no, I don't have all that time on my hands. Do you really think that I'm going to text four people at the same time and if they reply, if each one of them replies 20 seconds, no, like 10, 15, if each one of those people reply after 50 seconds, 15 seconds of me sending that, then i just be texting the whole entire day that's all I would be doing I wouldn't be doing anything else I wish people would understand I can't be productive when I'm fucking texting people like I can be productive when I'm on tumblr and stuff <laughs> but I can't be productive when I'm texting because you actually have to think about what you're gonna say you can't just be like haha yeah no you have to you have to think about something to say and I don't want people to like stop being friends with me because I'm such a shitty person like I can be a really really shit person sometimes Sometimes. Like, I'll just be like, <laughs> I don't know, it's just like that, you know? Like, I'll be like really just off putting and anti social sometimes. And that's okay, those are just the times when I need alone time. Um, HSC recommended two hours of alone time, no more than that, like in your room alone. 
each day of the weekend. I'm just like, uh, no, that'd be like two hours alone only the whole entire summer. Like, I'm pretty much in my room the whole day. Like, some people are just introverts, some are extroverts. You know, like, I'm an introvert. I don't like being around a ton of people and giving presentations is the worst and starting classes. Like, okay, some people I feel comfortable around and other people I'm just like, okay, you are just a bunch of judgmental pricks. And I've been having dreams, just a lot of nightmares. They weren't too intense, but this one, um, this girl Chelsea that's just behind me in health occupations, she was always yelling at me for something, and then I got an attitude with her, and we kind of just had an attitude toward each other, towards each other. Um, and Nathan and I would like have sex at my log cabin with, with my mom in the house. I don't know. Um, and I was always scared. He wouldn't want to talk to me again or anything. And someone told me, like after that, like I don't know, at the end of my dream somehow, somewhere at <laughs> the end of my dream that. <clears throat> I'm sorry I just cleared my throat. I shouldn't be doing that because I know somebody messaged me one time. They were like, hey, please don't do that. Thank you. Have a nice day. So I'm like, ah, oh, man, I feel bad. Uh. Okay. So, ah, uh, my breath tastes like onions and garlic. And it's disgusting because I just, like, had a binge of just, ah, uh, blah, blah. So, I'm going to take a shower after this. Okay. So, <laughs> I was talking about the Nathan thing. Okay. So... Yeah, someone was like, um, everyone just thinks you're really weird. Oh, no, no, no. This was Nathan, what he thought. Nathan thought I was just really, like, really weird, and I, they didn't know who I was, and I didn't even know who I was, and I wasn't, I didn't belong here, and I was, like, really just weird and not welcome. You're weird. I... I had a whole fear of mine of becoming weird. Like, I don't want to be weird again. Like, I was really weird in third grade through, like, seventh. And I just, ugh, so weird. And I, I hate myself for being so weird. Like, couldn't I have just been, like, the average person? Um, I wasn't, I was, oh my gosh. I don't want to talk about this. I'm uh, building myself up. This is to relieve stress, and it's just making me more stressed right now. Because I don't want to talk about these things, and my voice is really annoying my ears right now. Like, okay, so I was at Thanksgiving, and my grandpa just came and sat by me when I was on the computer um, deleting certain, like, items on it that were probably not too appropriate. And he almost saw it, and then he's just, like, asking me, like, so, what you gonna do when you get older? I'm just like, haven't we had this conversation, like, a hundred thousand times before? I don't need to talk about it again. And then she's like, I didn't say that. But, you know, I'm just like, I don't know. I, like, I know it, but I don't have it at, like, the back of my head all the time. Like, I don't, I don't remember these kind of things. They just pop up, you know? Like, I don't want to think about that right now. I, honestly, like, sometimes I just, I literally forget what I want to be when I grow up. And, no, like, I'm not gonna... I'm not going to grow up. I'm just, I can't take a ton of responsibility. It's too much for me. I can't handle it. Makes me suicidal, and I can't fucking handle it. <sighs> so, pretty much just the uh, um, obligation of texting people on time is stressing me the fuck out. Um, yeah, and I'm just so tired. I just want to go to sleep, but I won't, and I know that I just want to go and eat some apples and purge them. But is that going to help me? No, I'm going to feel like absolute shit, and I need to go and take a shower. Um, so I reached my lowest weight. I did, uh, 94.8 pounds yesterday. And I didn't weigh myself this morning, I was too tired, and I felt like, oh my god, what am I going to fucking weigh? And I didn't do it because I was scared. I was like, oh my gosh, what is this number going to be like? And Nathan looked like really hot today. And there's this guy named Brandon. Yeah, I know, I don't know. I might have talked about him in my videos before. But yeah, we're kind of starting a thing. And yeah. Uh, we've known each other for like since last year. We've been talking like ongoing since last year. So yeah. Who would have known? Dude, Jaden's gonna be so pissed when he finds out I'm dating Brandon. Like, if we put it on Facebook, he's gonna be like, yo, what the fuck? I thought he liked you while we were in a relationship, but he wanted you, you to break up with me for now. I'm just like, y y you broke up with me, and like, it just kinda happened that Haley was a 
bitch to him and so you know like just fell for him you know i'm just like hey he's free and all these girls i'm just like yo yo what up man so yeah i'm gonna go now because i need to shower and like just uh i need to sleep i need to sleep and i need to change my wall i have too much stuff on it that doesn't need to be there like my wall looks like a fucking depressive eating disorder wall there's too much about my eating disorder on it it's just it's not okay for Dutch or Brr or Mara because when Nathan comes over, I'm just like, okay, so this might be awkward because, like, what if I have vomit? Like, dude, what if I have vomit somewhere? That cup is filled with vomit. And I'm just like, yo, what if he, like, opens up the thing? I'm just like, ah, no, that was acid reflux. So, yeah, I got a I got your shower. So, yeah, you have a nice day. You have a nice day, madam and sir. Have a nice day. Uh -huh. Okay, so this isn't gonna go off without me, like, you know, pressing a button that's underneath that I can't exactly see or touch right now. So this may be a little bit awkward. And yeah. So if Molly sees this, I'm just gonna be like, I don't know. But I haven't self harmed since, I don't know, last time I self harmed. Which, yeah, that was on my wrist right there. Or, I don't even know, but whatever. It's really good that I haven't done it in a long time. So, I'm going to go now because I'm going to shower and just get on with my life. So, yeah, it's my life that I don't even have. So, yeah. I'm be like, bye-bye. I feel like I could die. Like, the next time I purge, well, I could die. The next time I binge or something, I'm like, my stomach could explode and all this other... Ew, I look like crap. Why is it so close? Okay. I look like crap, guys. You don't, you don't, you, you, you don't look at me right now, okay? Okay, let's look at this guy. Okay, it's something my grandma got me. But you know, she gave it to us. See, guys, look at how much shit I look like. I just look like a fucking weirdo. Ah, new jeans. Ah, la da da Ain't these cute? Yes, they are. And this mirror makes you look like way skinnier than I really am. Or... Who knows, mirrors are a mystery. So in reality, you never know what you look like. Ooh, bang, boom. Okay, so don't even ask. That's my purging toothbrush. You, you don't need to know. Those are orange peels, and this is makeup. So we're just going to, like, move that stuff. Ah, fuck. In penises. Okay, so. Okay, y'all, they had dessert. Like, did you hear the things like candy canes and plum or whatever? I'm just like, that is dessert. So, I'm going to go now because, like, I really got to go and shower before my mom gets home. So, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Alicia. Bye-bye.